taking it at Google. I mean, the people represent the ideas at Google. Do you, is there a way that you need to harness that strength, but not follow all the decisions of the people? Because a lot of people question whether or not it's too much now. There have been some big decisions that management has made at Google because the people were upset about whether it's the Pentagon contract or whether it's, you know, the AI ethical uh, unit. Is it too much? Well, well, in the Google context, one of our values is this kind of internal conversation. What Bill would say, I'm sure, is stick to your values, stay very focused on what you actually want to as a business. The reality is that today, these management jobs are harder and harder and harder because of social media and so forth. Yeah. And you've got to listen even more carefully to your employees. But at the end of the day, the old playbook, which is leadership, coaching, getting people who are often young and relatively inexperienced, huge potential to achieve their greatness, whatever it is, that is a universal human value. And our argument in the book is that these are applicable today and in the future. These are universal values of management and leadership. At some point, the leadership has to say, okay, I hear you, but what do I stand for? What do we stand for? And that's the values coming. And in the book, uh, you go through many of the lessons that Bill taught, in including people building trust, creating a workplace based on love. What does that mean? I mean, give me a practical idea based on love. Based on love means show up. If you're a manager and a coach, show up for your people. Uh, I like breathe that. confidence into them, make them, you know, be the evangelist for courage, and when time gets tough, show up. Well, it also means cheer. <laughs> Bill, would, Bill would clap like that in yeah. board meetings. In the middle of, of the meeting, just <laughs> for no good reason. <laughs> Maria, I love your show. It feels good, right? <laughs> That's great. That Everybody laughs. Like Everybody laughs. Express love in a meeting by audibly clapping and letting you know what a great job you've done. That is fantastic. And that creates momentum towards the decision. Yeah, and it moving. gets everybody buying in. Exactly. Haven't you sat in meetings where everybody's kind of bored? Yeah. Like, okay, let's get going, yeah. right? It's the same thing as winning in the game. It's funny how these little things yeah. really make a big difference. Let me ask you about AI. Google is among the senior companies so I highly recommend to my audience, check out the book. Uh, I found this interview very uh, interesting. That's why I'm sharing it with you guys. And obviously I like to talk about cryptocurrency and investing, but I believe that there's more to uh, being successful and a successful investor than just crunching numbers. And uh, if I do come across other content, I'll try to share it with you guys just to keep it interesting and uh, just mix things up. But uh, it looks like we are holding the level for uh, the 5,000 Bitcoin, which is nice, but we did have a little dip as you can take a look at this chart. Um, so I'll continue to also cover that in future uh, uh, videos, but let me know what you guys think and I will talk to you soon.